Hey y'all. Um, we are on our way to the doctor's appointment. What day is this for us? Day 14. 14. Two weeks. Uh -huh. Made it two weeks, y'all. Um, but just on the way to our doctor's, well, my doctor's appointment. See what they say. We gotta move that. Thing yeah. That's Golly. But other than the back thing, I feel good. You yeah, know, I feel all right. I mean, <laughs> I got sleep apnea and I messed around and fell asleep without my my mask last night, so I'm a little more tired than usual. But now it got me sleepy as hell, you know. Yeah, it's only Lies four hours of sleep. Yeah. Just recently got a sleep apnea machine in like April. And when I went to go take the test, they said I stopped breathing like 178 times or something like that. So I've been living with sleep and apnea for a whole long time and didn't even know. Shit crazy. Yeah, I kept telling him he needed to go get checked out. But he wanted to be stubborn like men are. But my back was hurting all through my sleep. So it was good and bad sleep, I guess. <laughs> all right, so I'm done with my doctor's appointment. Just waiting for babe to come and pick me up. <sighs> I was a little late to the appointment, so I wasn't sure if they was gonna actually see me or not. But um, she was able to, she couldn't see me for uh, both things that I wanted to because they were behind. Um, yeah. So I just did for my back. And yeah, so it's just the nerve, this, not the nerve. So some of my hips are locked. And so she just sent me to PT and prescribed me some muscle relaxers and some pain medicine for it. So I'm gonna do PT and see how it goes. Hopefully it helps. We'll see you guys back at the house. <coughs> I just decided, since I'm going to be going to PT, um, physical therapy, since I'm going to be going to physical therapy, um, I'm going to start working on mobility exercises. So I'm going to start doing yoga, Pilates, that type of stuff. I don't know about Pilates. Right, that's why we got to get that yoga um, mat ASAP. Yeah, so order us a yoga mat. So we're not going to get the prescription? No, they're not ready. Um, so maybe yeah, later today. Yeah, gave you some good stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Definitely needed it. Definitely needed it. Yeah, for sure. I got to start doing the mobility exercises too, for real. Like, I used to, I was always thinking I couldn't do it because I got degenerative disc disease. I got diagnosed with it a long time ago. My back been on fire for like the last two years and I've just been dealing with it. It's stupid. So... While she doing this, I might as well just join in. It's gonna be a whole nother journey. You about to get on this mobility journey. Yeah, cause it's not a good feeling, feeling like this. Like, I feel like my body is breaking down and that's not okay at all. I'm yeah. like, what are you doing? Nah, I, let them, <laughs> I, I flash the lights, let them know they good to get over. Um, but yeah, no, it's no, not a good yeah, feeling it's at not all. at all. And I've been, it been killing me for years. I ain't gonna lie. Somehow, I don't know how I been getting through it, but. I have been, you know, ibuprofen, a whole lot of ibuprofen, Tylenol, magnesium, every little uh, natural thing they say to try to get rid of the pain. That's what I've been doing all these years, but I can't even bend correctly. when it, I can't bend and grab something off the bed. It's ridiculous. So we're going to, uh, this this will be sparking my inspiration since she's got to get on her mobility thing. I was supposed to go to physical therapy too a long time ago. I was. <laughs> I was. They they prescribed me physical therapy and I didn't go. You know what though? Because I was embarrassed. I ain't gonna lie. It felt embarrassing because I'm so big. It felt like I'm gonna go inside the physical therapist and they just not even gonna be able to maneuver my body or something. I don't know. You know what I'm saying? And I'm probably wrong and I was probably wrong, of course, but I don't know. It just felt funny. I'm like, let me lose some of this weight first so I can even do some of the exercises that they'll have me doing. So 
don't know, man. But I'm gonna just start trying now. Now that we started being on this raw thing, I do feel a lot, lot, lot less inflamed. My back hurts a lot less than it did before. So I think I might be able to get to moving around and doing some of these physical therapy recommended exercises in. And look for inspiration and tips on these mobility exercises. I see it's a lot of people online getting to ages like ours. They say, you're not getting old, you just don't be doing shit. You just don't be moving the body the same way. So they say it's not because of age that you're feeling broken down. You're like, oh, my bag and you, your knees is cracking. It's because you don't do nothing. So yeah, so I got to do this. I got a job, Ooh, watch the, uh, the light. So I got a job right now where I got to do my big green screen. You gotta come over here, my little guy. I gotta set it right where you going. Oh, okay. But I got my green screen right here. See that big green screen I'm about to get set up. Now, a while back, I wouldn't have been able to bend down like this, honestly, eating like this. Look, my bend game is crazy. You see that, my little? I, I can really do that now. I was stuck before, so it's like, it really do feel like the uh, inflammation is a lot. Uh, it's down a lot. Yeah, so today is day 14. We two weeks in, y'all. You know what I'm saying? And I haven't ate anything today just yet. I'm thinking I'm probably going to kick it off with some grapes. That's my favorite thing to really eat. So, uh, yeah, we're going to keep getting to it. I'll see y'all in a little minute. All right. So while Babe's out there finishing up his work for his clients, I'm just about to probably take a nap. Um, this is all I had today was watermelon juice. Um, not really that hungry today, but I don't want the watermelon juice to go bad. So it was filled. I'm gonna just finish this up and then I really want to take a nap. I ain't gonna lie. And then later I got to make some spring rolls because I told everybody that I was going to make them today because I didn't make them tomorrow because I didn't make them yesterday. When we went grocery shopping. I didn't feel like doing nothing after we went grocery shopping. But I'm probably gonna make some spring rolls in a little bit. That'll probably be our dinner. Here, look, it's coming out. It just had to catch, I think. That's all. All right, so I decided that I am gonna make the spring rolls. Already got everything chopped up. Got cilantro, cucumber, some lettuce, um, carrots, green onions, red peppers, and orange peppers and then some zucchini noodles it looks all perfect all right y'all so dinner is ready we got the veggie spring rolls on deck you feel me and uh see over here cooking up the sauce real quick what the sauce coming like it's coming it's coming oh shit you know the sauce look like it's a mixture of coconut aminos and some sun butter sriracha some sriracha and, and some and some agave sauce that come out fire even though she forgot the recipe <laughs> I did. I did. there was a sauce we used to eat we used to eat these when we just because you know we tried plenty of time everybody know how to go you try plenty of times to lose weight right but so there was a time we were eating these and there was a sauce she used to make that was fire and uh she don't quite right remember the recipe. I don't. I, I'm going to write stuff down from now on because right. I, just, I don't remember at all. Right. Because when it's in your head and you make it all the time, then, of course, you remember it. But when you start making it, all of a sudden, it's, it's right. gone. That's like me with the biscuit. But, see, I wrote the biscuits down. Yeah. For the first time ever, I wrote something down. I'll never write anything down, y'all, for real. Don't She's the writer down to her. Oh, let me go see. Let's see what it's whipping up like. Oh, it's all <laughs> Can't see nothing. There it go. What does it taste like when you just taste it? I, it, it it yeah, it's like it's coming along. I guess that's how much we use, honestly. Yeah, no, nah, that's it. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, maybe a little more spice. Okay. Just a little more coconut sriracha. Now, we ain't never gave an explanation or breakdown yet of what it is we actually doing. We are calling it raw fast. A lot of times I put it in a title and call it a raw fast, but it's really like high raw. Yeah. Because some of the stuff we eat, I guess, wouldn't qualify under some of the people that's being like super duper right. strict high raw, like raw, what you would call raw. So ours is like all raw fruits and vegetables. We're not cooking nothing. But as with the with the rice wraps, we got the, we got the spring roll rice wraps and 
We got stuff like the, I don't know, the agave. I don't know what counts, honestly. I ain't looked into it. Well, we no, just doing agave's something. Agave's raw. Agave count? Yeah, because it's, it's raw agave. Uh, it's I raw agave. Raw agave. Mm -hmm. Some butter is probably not raw. Yeah, no. This is raw. Well, because it's roasted, is. but the coconut amino go in there. I'm not 100%. I ain't dive too deep into sin. I just knew we was just doing fruits and vegetables. You feel me? We 98% raw. Right. Because that's about it. Right. And we're not trying to be like exact. It's nobody's exact plan that we're following. We're just going fruits and vegetables right. and being like as maximum healthy as we possible as what we feel. Right. You know and what we're saying? still dropping weight, so it doesn't matter. Right. Mostly we do we do the raw wraps with the lettuce, though. We did do that. Yeah. A lot of our meals have been lettuce wraps, but tonight is going to be the spring roll wrap. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's made out of rice flour, and that's cool. That's all right. Everybody do their own thing. We're not here to judge anybody. I have to say that. We're not here to, <laughs> yeah, but there's new people watching every yeah. single time. We're not here to judge anybody, At right? All. I don't care if you're doing keto, carnivore, plant-based, vegan, you know what I mean? Whatever's working whatever for you, is, you know what I'm saying? Whatever's healthy for you and whatever you, if, if whatever you're doing is accomplishing that goal, then stick to it. Right. You know you, and that's all that matters. Right. I'm not here to convince anybody anything. I'm not here to act like I know everything or I know anything. You know what I'm saying? So when people leave comments and things, I, I take the advice. I go look into it. You know what I'm saying? It might not be what I'm going to do, but I'm going to still look into it. I hear you. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not here. It's a judgment-free zone. You know? But I'm here to motivate and inspire, you know, with hopefully with the vlogs. That's why we put the journey. That's why we expose so much of ourselves right now. And that's what we're attempting to do is give some people some insight on what it looked like to do something and better your own health and better your life and you know what I'm saying? Try to maintain some sort of discipline, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know, cause it's, it's hard. It's hard to maintain the discipline. As you see, I've been fat. I had this, this channel been up for seven years. Yeah, seven years. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this channel been up for seven years, y'all. But the journey must continue. You feel me? You can't never stop. What they say, you only fail when you stop trying. So that's where we at with it. So you know what I'm saying? It's looking fire. She done put it together. That's her, y'all. When you see the stuff <laughs> extra organized and put together all pretty and stuff on the plate, that's her. Me, this, it would not look like that. It ain't gonna look smooth. All right, so that's day 14 in the bag, y'all. We about to eat dinner. This big old plate. We got a big plate. We be eating in the bed. Don't judge us. Y'all don't, don't judge us. <laughs> Oh, and we want to thank all the subscribers and all the new subscribers, mm -hmm. all the people that just be watching us. Right. We really, truly do. Right. We see y'all comments. We see y'all. Mm -hmm. We appreciate y'all. I'm glad that some people said they, they're inspired by what we're doing. Yeah. And like, that's what it's about. You know what I'm saying? Just trying to expose ourselves in a journey mm -hmm. so that other people can follow along with us. You know yeah. what I'm saying? And uh, so, yeah, we about to eat this dinner. We hungry. As usual, we only ate fruit and stuff all day. Mm -hmm. We only got one meal a day. It's only that was it. dinner time is the main meal, right? Yeah. So, yeah. So, we're going to get to it. It's looking delicious. She done made something super fire. So, yeah. All right. So, that's day 14 in the bit egg. We'll see y'all in the next one. Yes, sir. I had to get this. back on here and tell y'all that adding these sushi, sushi, what is it? Seaweed wraps <clears throat> into the spring rolls made it taste like you're eating a... Uh, a real sushi roll like it tastes really good that mixed with the avocado in it mm, it's delicious bro yeah, i'm it. i'm making some more tomorrow <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah that seaweed hidden well, that's the hit right there it do taste like a sushi uh a sushi roll wrap mm -hmm. this sauce is fire too this sauce that she made is crazy hold on it's dripping here i don't know if i can try to show them what it looked like <clears throat> That's what the whole, that's what the wrap looked like. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's a crazy mix. We should have put that in here before. Right? Man, yeah. we was missing out this whole time. <laughs> <For real. laughs> but, right, y'all. We'll see y'all tomorrow. Out of here.